blue skies and you yeah, not, uh, what is it, not sea, breeze. sea breezes? Explain not all. Not quite sea breeze. A sea breeze is something that develops during the day. This is just a general northerly wind that will be with them throughout. But uh, lovely scene this morning, isn't it? Across at uh, Sandwich at the uh, the course there. Uh, right close to the coast, though, not much in the way of shelter. So that's why the breeze is key, I think, for the golfers. Over the next few days, quite a brisk one coming in from the north or northeast. But the breeze eases this weekend. And whether you're in the breeze or not, there will be some pretty strong sunshine overhead. Bear that in mind if you are heading off to the uh, golf at all over the next few days. And indeed, anywhere across the UK, there will be some pretty strong sunshine around uh, right through the, uh, the rest of this week and into the weekend. And with it, temperatures will be on the rise too. It's all because this area of high pressure, southwest of the moment, will be pushing its way in. Not quite with us yet. That's why we've got that northerly breeze down eastern areas. And we've got weather fronts toppling around, bringing some cloud with it too. A cloudy start in Northern Ireland, northwest England, north Wales. That will break up. We'll see some sunny spells. But we'll see a bit more cloud develop across England and Wales compared to the sunny conditions most of you have got at the moment. There'll still be some cloud down those eastern coasts throughout and uh, more in the way of thicker cloud into the Western Isles later, which could bring some drizzle. Temperatures today, though, 24, 25 degrees around uh, the likes of Aberdeenshire, also across the Lake District and towards southeast Wales. These are the highest temperatures, a bit cooler down those breezy eastern coasts. That breeze remains in place, East Anglia, the southeast through tonight. A bit breezy to the northwest of Scotland with some cloud and some patchy rain. And it's always going to be here. We stick with lots of cloud over the next few days. But in between, clear skies through the night into the morning. Maybe temperatures down into single figures for one or two of you. But overall, it should be a nice enough start to tomorrow. And this is this chart for Friday. High pressure nudging its way in. Got the cloud on it as well just to show how it drifts around the western and northern edge. Continuing to push in to northwest of Scotland. But elsewhere, some of the cloud will break up. In the morning, lots more in the way of sunshine around for many. Just a bit of fair weather cloud into the afternoon and brightening up towards East Anglia southeast after a cloudy start. The breeze starting to ease down a little bit. Could get even warmer tomorrow across eastern parts of Scotland and temperatures rising across the south of England and Wales. Both could get to around 26 or 27 degrees. As we head into the weekend, high pressure becomes more firmly established. Still around the top of it, though, we'll see some cloud patchy rain across the highlands and islands. A cooler here compared with elsewhere. Temperatures down a little bit across Scotland compared with uh, what we'll see over the next few days, but continuing to climb across central and southern and eastern England, 27 to 28 or 29. And as we go through Saturday night into Sunday, the high pressure is still firmly with us. These weather fronts will bring some further cloud, patchy rain across the north of Scotland, and there will be some sunshine at times, particularly for Orkney and Shetland, and a cooler day for Scotland and Northern Ireland with that increased amount of cloud. But by Sunday, Nag and Charlie, we could be seeing the peak of the heat. 30 degrees possible and some pretty warm nights to come as well. Back to you both. Matt, thank you very much.